Uh, let's just take a look at this line. If you have not used Dynamo line before, uh, it is nice, strong stuff. Very strong, uh, sometimes referred to as Amp Steel or Dynamo. Good line, very powerful, thin, light, etc. Also, if you're interested in splicing, it opens up and you can get into the structure of the line real easily. Anyway, what do you got here? You got three pieces. Uh, this red section uh, may work on your winch or may not. It sort of depends on the configuration of your winch, but basically it's not a load-bearing section of line. It's just meant to get it going. So you would attach this to your winch, roll up the red, and if you got to the red, it's kind of like a warning. It's telling you don't go that far. You've gone too far. Anyway, this is the load-bearing section, the gray, and then at the end, you've got some sheathed line, and I like that. I like the sheathing. Basically, you've got a splice under there. Uh, it's spliced in a loop around this hook here, and the, sh the sheathing kind of covers your splice. It feels to me like the splice goes about one foot. It goes to about right here. So that covering just kind of covers it over. You do not need to provide your own hook. It's got this pretty beefy looking hook shackle type thing, which I, I kind of like. It's actually better than the ones I've seen. It's got a pin, fits through here, and there you go. Again, if you haven't used Am Steel, I would recommend it. Dynama or Am Steel, it's usually called. It's just excellent light, doesn't kink, very strong stuff.